Hello friends, welcome to the channel. Today in this video, we are going to discuss how to make a concept map on Google Docs. Okay, let's start then. So, what we will do is, we will, uh, let's navigate to uh, docs.google.com. Okay, so now I am here. Uh, this is docs.google.com and uh, let's create one blank document. Okay, click on this uh, plus icon or the blank option to create a, a brand new Google Docs document. Okay, so what we'll do here, we'll try to, uh, you know, create a concept map manually. Okay, using the drawing option. Okay, so what we'll do is uh, just click on the insert menu. Okay, then the drawing option and uh, click on the plus new option. Okay, so now you can able to see this drawing window. Okay, so as a next step, what you can do is click on the shape option. Okay, select shapes and you can take the rectangle. I mean, you can take any shape, but uh, whatever uh, demo we'll do here, we'll just use a rectangle. Okay and then what you can do is go to the shape again okay select the shapes and take this rounded rectangle okay that looks pretty good so i'll take this okay now i can use ctrl c to copy this shape and make it around three okay so i can we will rearrange it properly just drag it and able to see you can drag it just like that okay so now wh what you'll do is uh, we will connect this uh, boxes or rectangle and this uh, round rectangle shape okay you can connect it uh, with the help of some arrow and uh, lines right so click on this select line drop down okay choose line so what i can do is just draw this line you have to align it properly okay just delete it now what my intention is what i'll do is i'll put a line here then next to that I will put a text box just click on this text box okay click here just write something uh, like say I will type python okay now you can align it drag it properly and align it at the center okay little off okay okay now it looks good next what you can do is uh, take this arrow okay click on that arrow okay so you can drag it and join it properly okay uh, what you can do the next thing is similarly you can copy this i mean hold the control key select this three okay copy it control c and control v control v so intention is i'll copy the same thing i mean you can drag it one by one See, uh, either you can make it uh, on the same way how you have done it for the first one or you can you know copy these things and paste it and you can align it then okay so now what I'll do is I'll modify this text say I'll make it uh, Azure okay and here I'll modify it uh, Docs and then you can connect it properly 
to the top box okay it's purely up to you how you want to make it and which angle and all okay. and then same way you can connect here connect here okay so this looks good okay done so you can just uh, connect like this slide down you can make it okay now it is better okay so what you'll do next is uh, you know uh, we we want to you know enter some text on these uh, boxes we just double click there and uh, type some text say, say i'll type your websites okay you can select the text and uh, choose more and make it central aligned okay in fact i mean you can change whatever you want like times new Roman I'll make it I and mean, font font size and all this customization you can do based on your need say so i'll make it bold okay this looks better so here again double click on the box i'll type your azure lessons okay can make it slight bigger so that to wrap the text you can select the text again and make it central lined make it bold just ignore it okay then double click here i'll make it i'll write python guides okay drag it slightly so that it will wrap the text properly okay then uh, make it times new remon and we can make it bold also i'm sorry here we'll also change it to times new remon then here i'll double click again i'll enter docs tips again i'll make it central lines make it bold again times new roman uh, okay looks good so you can able to see uh, this concept map we have made okay so act, ideally you can use any of the shape from here and drag it you can use the arrows the lines to connect them and provide all the information whatever you need okay now what you can do is either uh, you can click on save and close so that it will add this uh, map to your uh, google docs document or what you can do is you can simply click on download and uh, download as pdf or jpg or png whatever you want okay you can click on save and close it will add this map to your google docs document right well this is what for today i thought to discuss you know how to make a concept map on uh, google docs so we have covered that ideally whatever shape you want to use you can choose you can select from the shape option and you can draw it in the drawing window as per your requirement this is a simple demo with i thought to show you a quick demo on how to make a concept map on google docs thanks for watching the video i hope you like the video if you like the video kindly subscribe to our channel you will get lots of free videos on uh, google docs and google drive tips 
Thanks again. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.